Offset and Cardi B are the perfect couple in every single way. When it comes to showing each other how much they appreciate and love them, they always show out every holiday, every birthday. It doesn't matter what the occasion is. Even just because gifts with them, it is always top tier. I love it. This is how you celebrate your partner. If you have the money to do so, this is beautiful, hands down. Everyone's love language is different, so you just have to know your partner, what they like, what will keep them happy, and just keep the relationship fresh. This is amazing. Every year, I lie to you not, he finds some way to just top the last year. Like It's crazy to me because I don't know how he does it. I just love their relationship. They're from two separate sides of town, and they just go so well together. My baby did that. I love him. Mm -hmm. That's a real nigga right there. He knows, he knows my body. He knows what I like, the gifts I like, the vibe I like, everything. That's my nigga right there. I love him. I'm drunk and I'm up because I gotta get up early for community service but I love that nigga hanging off that oh, period girl I feel you like what I love y'all relationship but make sure you guys check out Cardi B and Offset's McDonald's meal let me know how you guys like it I'm not gonna lie a lot of people always say money bag and Ari's relationship is for publicity and it's not real but one thing I do know is the way they love each other and just put on for the cameras. I don't know what it is, but I like their relationship. I think he has made her a more humbled woman. You know, before she was so, I don't want to say ratchet, but ugh, you know how she was, you know. But I just love that for her, you know. Like, he makes her a better person. And one thing they're going to do is buy each other a new car. Because he just bought her a new Bentley. Like, what? Period. When you truly love someone, it's going to change you for the better. You know, you're going to grow. You're not going to want to be the same person you were last year. Let's get into Jazz and Crystal. Now, they are on vacation in Jamaica, Jamaica. Out. Boop, boop, boop. I was a little skeptical on Jazz and Crystal, but one thing I'm not is a hater. And if Jazz love her, then I love her too. All I know is Jazz is just loving this relationship. I do believe that Crystal does bring Jazz a breath of fresh air. Like, she's fun. She's outgoing. You know, just the person that Jazz is today, I feel like her and Crystal go well together. Because the jazz wasn't this outgoing and, you know, out there like she was before when she was with Tay. But, you know, different relationships does bring that out of you. I know you guys have been seeing a lot of back and forth on Twitter with DDG and his ex, Ruby Rose, and his current girlfriend, Haley. Ruby Rose is saying that DDG was trying to talk to her and get her to come over and so on. Who knows? Honestly, my thing is, DDG seems happy with Haley, and Haley seems happy with her man, and she's going to stick beside him. She currently just posted and said that she enjoyed her Valentine's Day. This was the best one yet. She hasn't posted anything, but DDG did post to his Instagram that he was in Ghana, and I just think that is beautiful for who they are, I think being in Ghana was amazing Valentine's Day. I'm not going to lie. That is the best one yet. Now, let's get into one of our favorite YouTube couples, Aman and Regine. Aman did surprise Regine with a trip to Cancun for Valentine's Day. Not only did he do that, he also spiced it up with the index challenge so Regine did pick a few cards before valentine's day where she did win money and a new bag for her trip he did emphasize that he wanted her to use the money to get her nails and her hair done because he knew he was taking her out of town 
I have nothing bad to say about this couple here. You know, I just love the growth in Armand as far as going out. You know, he wasn't really a going out type of person. He likes to focus on work and be work orientated. But now he's trying to enjoy his life. And I just love that for him. I just love how they compliment each other all around. They, you know, they love to dress. They love to take pictures. They love to work. Like, they're just so perfect for each other. You know, some relationships do struggle with that where one partner may overshadow the other. But in this relationship, I think they do not feel any type of way. They feel like they're on the same page. And that is beautiful. I just had to throw this in there because I know you saw Harvey with her man Damson last night. Oh my god, they are so fine. I love him. I love the show Snowfall. And hopefully this is the one for her.